And now, the grand finals. So Green Arrow. Green Arrow versus Carl's cornucopia of characters. Let's give Christy some credit here. Once again, Christy, who a lot of times fails to get top three at the locals, outplaces all those players that beat him there at the major. Not only did he outplace them, he, he beat, them. beat them. He beat them. And it was the same story at ECT. You know, right. Loses, it the, you know, it loses, loses to CD Jr. at next level. Well, at East Coast Throwdown, he beat him. He beat Rio here at Christy is in. For some reason, we forget that Chris G is like one of the absolute top players in this game. And Carl's going black at him here. And that's, this is, I don't like this. This is a character Chris G has a lot, a of, lot experience of experience. A lot of experience with, with right. The East Coast is filled with Green Lantern and Black Adam. However, I did play Carl's Black Adam. And while he's new and it's very basic, I thought it was pretty good and it really suited him. It's based around the dive kicks. Right, it's literally nothing but dive kicks. Well, he figures he's got three more days of it, so. Right. Yeah, because you can't punish it. There's Chris G. He's no, that jumping three is so good. Oh, there you go. Wow, shoots him out of the dive kick with an arrow. Jumping three. Another jumping three with. Perfect Legend using a lot of meter here. Throws the interactable, does not hit. Christy back dashes it. And say cheese. Why did he do that? <laughs> he figures he'll build the meter right back. Probably. He just wants to get him off the... There we go. And Chris D is slowly but surely building that meter back up. Now, Green Arrow is not going to build. He doesn't do a whole lot of special. Right. But he also doesn't use a lot of meter burn moves normally. Exactly. So it kind of balances itself out. Oh. Wow. Yeah, if Purple Lesson gets hit by a nice arrow here. Yeah, he's done. Yeah, back threes. But first he's got a loaded. Yeah, he's not gonna let oh, he's loaded. Oh, there he goes. Good block. Ow. Good push block. Get out of the corner. A dive kick. We lose to that jumping three. There we go. Close first game. Perfect legend. What else will this always be a world of? We found out yesterday this will always be a world of Cabal. I think we're now finding out this will always be a world of perfect legend. This will always be a world of down, uh, down playing. I mean, Chris G has got a, I think, yeah, Chris G's had a lot of trouble loading that ice arrow right. that last game. So Good cross up. That jump two was built for cross ups. That's yeah. the kind of move where they design that, and they're like, this is a cross-up. Well, because move. the move is, you can do it at the top of the head, and yeah. it's totally ambiguous. And he's got a great jump arc. And Good there punish. it comes. Chris G not using the interactable there. I'm surprised he's not using the interactable at all there. And it's there for PL to use, maybe. And Chris G probably could have put it away there with the interactable. Oh, good, Ooh, throw, good throw break. I love that throw oh. break animation where they just push you away. Yeah, One hand me. So Christy takes first life right there. We go lightning. Now it's even. And then. Oh, there we go. Don't, there we go. Christy gonna. Goes ahead and does it. Now we'll get the transition. Yep. Oh, wasn't close he, enough. Is he gonna, he does not use the transition. That's it. Now he will.
Knocks him all the way down. Um, even though PL has Clash right here, he's not really going to be able to use it. And Christy has those fire arrows. Ow. This is all falling apart very quickly. Oh, no. One Say to one. Cheese. And is he going to character select? Scorpion. Going with Scorpion. And here we have Scorpion. And Perfect Legend chooses this stage. Over the pig. Now that is, this is actually not, Big D was doing very well, he says, right. against Scorpion. So this is not like people think, apparently. That Scorpion will not air to air Green Arrow, and that's something that apparently Scorpion players don't take into account losing the air to air battle consistently. Puts the vortex on him. Oh, I guess it's wrong there. Yeah. Air Good to air to air. Chooses not to transition, he'll go into this corner combo. That's smart. Oh, that was cool. Oh, there we go. There we go. See that it beat. Oh, perfect legend. Really not knowing what to do about that jumping three. And burns it. He's going to avoid to. Oh, Hellfire. Hellfire. Christy's sitting on a full stock here, though. Good down one ice arrow. On yeah, Perfect super. Legend's got to be careful here. And that's oh. It. I'm surprised he did not. Like, well, even if he clashed, he would have lost. Better than lose to lose 30 than 55. Right. And here it comes. Back three. Forward three. Four, three. 44% yeah. unbreakable. It's 55 with the uh, interactable. Awesome. Got the bad thing is, yeah, he's bringing all, getting all that meter right back now. Air to air. Oh, call doesn't clash in time. Yeah, he still would have lost the clash anyway. Because Christy had the ball. Two to one. Yeah, two to bar. Two Chris to one. G is now one game away from winning CEO. I remember when Chris G won UFGT, there were a lot of posts saying, Green Arrow won a major. Well, that just proves out that, you know, that was free. And yet Chris G in the grand finals of another major with Green Arrow. They, they blew him up simply because of the terrible players or player that he loses to on the East Coast. So they but blew up everybody can beat everybody. That's that's true. That's the thing. But like you know, in the community, they don't. People need to understand yeah. that. So I, I don't. I don't. I don't. Is this the typical thing where Carl has given up and goes to a wacky character? Does he even play Cyborg? I uh, no. One of Carl's few downsides as a player is when he mentally gives up. And, and the thing about Cyborg me. is. We have a lot of those. Right. I Cyborgs, mean, Green Lanterns, and what's his name? Uh, Black Adam is what basically the dominant characters right. that you see. And Superman. Maybe he'll maybe he'll prove me wrong here, but this seems very strange. I think he's having a hard time staying away from that Green Arrow bow. I don't know. Is he trying to get away from that? Or? I don't know what's going on here, but this is tournament point for Chris G. G is just yeah. There we go. And now he's got super. Now he's got and if super. Carl gets hit here, it's over. Because and Chris G has such a life. He's, it's going to interactable, right? Him. And he can still throw those at Cyborg also. Probably. Chris G probably want to learn one frost arrow here to get the. Yeah. There you go. You're exactly right. One trade. Carl's in a lot of trouble. One trade. 
That's yeah, it. This is it. Wow. Why does he let it expire? <laughs> I, I yell at him every time and he goes, yeah, I know. I mean, I did. This is it. Back three. Dash up back. Oh, we could have knocked him through it. One more hit. That's and it. Chris G has won. CEO 2013. We win in this tournament. Scorpion, 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 Scorpion. And in the end, Green Arrow has won CEO. Yep. Green Arrow. Green Arrow. Chris G won. Congratulations to everybody. Huge congratulations to the top eight. The whole, everyone. Shout outs to Green Arrow. An incredible story here. I don't think anyone predicted this. I, I hope I hope the community has learned something from this. And I hope that there are a lot of people out there that have a lot to hold. And I'd like to see some accountability from people. I'd like to see people come out and say, you know what, maybe, maybe we were wrong. Because Green Arrow has won CEO. And that's incredible. That's hype. We are two weeks away from Evo. And this just proves nobody knows what's going to happen. Harley in the top eight. Absolutely Two of the top guys in the top eight were people that no one knew of except for online players. Absolutely incredible here. This game keeps getting crazier and crazier these early six months where anything can happen. I'm so pumped up for Evo. And I also want to you know, give a big shout-out to Jabali. CEO, in my opinion, is the, the standard of tournaments. Um, Every, every tournament out there should strive to be like CEO. I say yeah, this constantly. Yeah. I say Huge shout-outs to him. Uh, there was a lot of drama on Twitter drama between GGA and Jabali, and he was very cool. He, he came up to me several times. He asked, what do you think of the tournament? Do you have any criticism? Do you have anything you want to say? It was very, run, he was very cool for MK. Yeah. He really went out of his way to help the MK and Injustice scene. Huge, huge shout-outs to Jabali. Uh, yeah. I, I thought it was an awesome tournament. I did. And, uh, you know, thanks for everyone. Thanks for, you know, running the stream and everything. Yeah. And, you know, awesome commentary by you as well. You All know. right, everybody. Chris All right, G. Chris G wins.